What's up guys, it's Bucky and welcome to your 15th Pi Game tutorial. And in this tutorial, we're going to be going over something called a vector. Now what a vector is, is, is pretty much the line that connects two points. So if you had a point in the top left corner and a point in the bottom right corner, it would be that imaginary line between those two points. So a vector has two main um, attributes. It has both a distance between those points and it also has a direction from point A to point B. And we're going to be working with vectors because it's really important when you're building games for 2D games and it's um, especially important when we're going to be building 3D games in the future. So these next couple uh, series of tutorials is going to be going over vectors and it's going to seem like a pain now but I'll make it real easy for you and trust me when we're building our 3D graphics um, you're definitely going to need to know this so that's why. Now most people when they build vectors um, they put it they pretty much build a class for the vector because we're going to be doing a bunch of different functions to it so we're going to want its own class so we can uh, use those functions easily so go ahead and build a class again I deleted every single thing um, for my last tutorial so go ahead and build a class and actually let me open up my there we go and uh, you can name it anything you want I'm gonna go ahead and just name mine vector and for your parameter of course put object and we're only going to be building a uh, one function or method in this um, this is the initialization uh, function so go ahead and def underscore underscore i n i t underscore underscore and this is um, in case you never bought built an initialization function for whenever we create an instance of this class this is what it does automatically so whenever we create an instance we're gonna pass it three parameters and I know I didn't tell you guys before I probably should have all this function is gonna do is calculate difference from point A to point B so we need the self um, parameter first which is um, pretty much the instance and then list one and list two since we're gonna be passing it to list or two coordinates and it's gonna calculate the difference so let's do that right now make um, a variable called self diff which is gonna be um, in other words our instance uh, dot diff you'll see what it is later on you should know this if you watch my uh, Python tutorials and the formula for calculating uh, the distance or vector between two coordinates is the first thing we have to do is take the first coordinate of our second list so list two and zero because remember the first one is zero I know that's confusing minus list one zero so this is going to give us our our difference between um, the first point and now to get the difference between the second point go list two one here we go minus list one one make sure I got that word right this two zero one zero two one 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 so what this is going to do is take the first coordinate from our second list actually I'll tell you whenever I uh, make a list so anyways um, after we get done calculating that we're just going to want to print out our answer so print self diff and now that's the only thing we need to build in our class for now we only have one function and it's our constructor function so next let's go ahead and make a list and then after I do this you're gonna see what's going on uh, make a list called a and I know that um, I call a list a tuple but just deal with it and we'll make it like 20.0 for the first coordinate 25.0 for the second one make another point which is B and set this equal to something like 40.0 and also 55 Point oh. So these would represent points A and B. 20.0 would be 20 over, 25 down, and B would be 40 over, 55 down. So let's go ahead and after this, what we want to do is create an instance of our class. So just name it thing or whatever you want and set it equal to your class name. 
with your parameters being A and B. And what this is going to do is take um, the A coordinate, or excuse me, A point and B point, and pass them in here and calculate the difference. And I'll show you guys um, after I run it how this does it. Let's go ahead and run the module, click OK, and we're going to get, uh, oh man, you can almost see it. We're going to get 20 and 30. So what this did is calculated 40 minus 20, which was 20, and 55 minus 25, which was 30. Now let me show you guys visually how this does it. Um, this is represents list 1, since it's the verse first variable passed in is A and B represents list 2 so whenever you see list 2 it's B so list 2 the first coordinate is 40 minus list 1 the first coordinate which is 20 so that's what gives you the 20 and in list 2 the second coordinate which is 55 minus list 1 the second coordinate which is 25 this gives you the 30 so that's your real basics on how to build a vector class and I know it might seem confusing for now but after you watch me do this a couple times or you practice with it it's going to be a lot easier so um, play around with that and probably once you build it you're going to understand what's going on but if not I'll clear things up for you in the next couple tutorials so thank you guys for watching and don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you next time